Did you watch the eclipse? Where were you? What did you think? Leave it in the comment section. Let me go ask my two pals over here. The guy with the cowboy hat on is my hayseed Gen Z Isaiah. How are you? Doing good. Next to him is a very good looking fellow by the name of Marcus Stamos. How are you, buddy? Total eclipse of the heart. That's what I had today. Yeah. Total eclipse of the heart. You, what does that mean? I didn't get to see it. So your heart was broken. dark and cold and black because you didn't get to see the eclipse. Yeah, total ecli well, it wasn't a total eclipse, but eclipse, yeah. Yeah, well, it was a total eclipse for some people, but not for us. Yeah, we were in the we were too far east, I think. You were too yeah. far east. So Darn it. Technically, what we got, from what I was told, was like an 85%. Couldn't tell it. Eclipse. Could you? Did it get darker? Looks like it just... That clouded in It seemed like it got a little bit darker, but not. No. Did you guys not. go out and put the thing on and look at no. it? No. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, it would have been hard to tell had you not done that because, well, number one, it was partly cloudy today, you know, the day of the eclipse. There were clouds in the sky. Right. So you can't, unless you had something to look at it with, you wouldn't have even seen it. But, uh, it did, so it just looked like, if you didn't know if today was eclipse, it would just look like a cloudy day. I did look up. I did look out the window and looked up and hurt my eyes. Yeah. I looked at it. <laughs> I, they tell you not to look well, you at saw it. Me but I did see here. like something, you know, blocking the yeah. sun. Well, I had two Half pairs light. of sunglasses. I had these and then two another light. pair underneath these. And I looked up at it and you could see, you could see the moon shadow coming up in there. Mm -hmm. um, so I didn't. The two pair of glasses worked. Yeah. So you didn't need to go out and buy a pair of eclipse glasses. Nah, just two pairs. Of what something. are that? What's the difference? Chris, our buddy Chris Fry, who works here, also had the official eclipse glasses, and uh, you could see through the clouds, and you could see the the either the oh. moon or the shadow shadow of the moon. I think it's the moon. Yeah. yeah. No, the shadow of the moon is sun. on us, but we're looking at the moon. Yeah. Going in front of the sun. Yeah. So. It's wonder it didn't. It's crazy how it doesn't melt, huh? How, what's that? It's pretty crazy how the moon does melt going in front of it. Doesn't like melt. Yeah. Yeah. You would think. Yeah. Because with all the direct sunlight, it seems like it's really close to it. Mm hmm I mean, cheese does melt. That's and what we were And the moon taught. is made out of cheese. cheese. That's all I thought as a kid. Because if you look at it, you can see the little chunks taken out of it, like yeah. the mouse has had a part of it. How does this apply to people who believe that the Earth is flat? Or well, how do they factor this in? How do we know that it's not flat? Hmm? Okay, so how does this factor in into your life? <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't. Yeah, I just go with it. Flat, round, uh, yeah. cheese, or rock. <laughs> I'm fine. All right. Well, so you didn't really get to experience it, Isaiah. Did you said you did or did not look at it? I didn't look at it. Yeah, you didn't miss much. There'll be another one. Why didn't in you about four years? Were you doing not to look at it? I was just inside watching Netflix. Yeah. yeah. I remember uh, I was in L.A. during one eclipse, and I forgot about it. And I got in my car to go get some food or something. And it looked, everything looked like a green tent to me. It looked like, yeah. yeah. And, I did, and I was hoping to see that again this time, but I didn't, I didn't notice anything about it. So anyway... What was your experience? Were you in the actual zone that was a total eclipse? You know, what all? I wonder what happened today. Like, do you think, like, this affected the economy in, in any way? It could have. You know, I always I thought I told a lot of people this is a perfect time for an attack of some kind, some kind. Oh, like a terrorist attack. A terrorist attack, or they could come at us from underneath. Because yeah, yeah, tell we're me looking more. up, right? Okay, so everybody, everybody was everybody's looking up Everybody's doing today. this. So you attack from underneath. You, they could have got us from underneath today, easily. Terrorists left money on the table today. Wow, because your attention totally. So when you say attack from underneath, you mean like guys walking around just foot sweeping people, or or like what's the big attack? Is it just small attacks? That there's probably like bombs planted over the when it's dark. Oh, so the, the night before, they go to plant a bunch of bombs, yeah. like landmines. And then everybody's looking up today, so they could have activated them. They're today. out there walking around. Yeah. Wow. Hearts and sparks. 
I'm glad that they're not as smart as you, the terrorists. Cannot believe they didn't think of it. Maybe the next, when's the next one? The next terrorist attack or next eclipse? Clips. 2044. There's, apparently there's one like, what, every month somewhere on the earth? Really? Somewhere on the 2044? earth. 2044? It, it Maybe in America. Uh, yeah. The guy who uh, we asked to Google things, perhaps you could Google that. When is the next uh, solar eclipse? 24, that's 20 more years, so. I think it, the last one that happened where we could see it in North Carolina, I was in the sixth grade. And I remember, yeah. Yeah, I remember that. And I remember uh, having to go out in the courtyard and they had shoe boxes and yeah. stuff, and I remember that. Yeah. But, but I don't know. 2044, we'll do it again, but we'll probably be in assisted living or something by the end. No, by then we'll be, we'll be on a spaceship, dude. Oh. That will tour around yeah. the sun. Or by then they'll do something to prevent it, maybe. So, yes, it is another 20 years before there's a chance for us to witness a solar eclipse. Chance. Eclipse. I'll be 72. Yeah. Wow. Good luck. Is there anything you want to tell your 72-year-old self? Yeah. Look at the camera and talk to yourself. As at, a, at 72? At, no, how old are you now? 51. A 71-year-old. I want a 51-year-old Marcus to talk to a 71-year-old Marcus and tell him what he should and should not do during this solar eclipse. Oh, during this solar eclipse. Yeah, the next one that's coming. You, yeah, so we're going to act like it's... Yeah, you're going to talk to the camera like you're talking to yourself yeah. from the past. Uh, don't waste your time. Stay in, <laughs> stay in and watch Jeopardy. It's not worth it. I didn't... Perfect. Stay in the nursing home and watch Jeopardy. <laughs> <laughs>